guys, my name is Christine and today is Sunday, October 6, 2024 and for today's video, I'm gonna show you how to make chicken adobo in Bicolano style. So, um, as far as I'm concerned, I'm a proud Bicolano and I'm gonna show you how, what are the procedures of making the chicken adobo. So first, we heat the pan. So, for today's video, I already pre-boiled the chicken so that um, um, it's gonna be well cooked because sometimes there's still some blood inside the chicken. So what I did is I pre-boiled it and set it aside. Now, we put first the... And basically, we're just going to add all the ingredients and let it simmer, let it boil for 20 to 25 minutes. So since it's already pre boiled, I'll put the onions. Onion and the garlic. All the salt, chili, pepper, and secret of all that magic syrup. Alright, guys, since we put all the ingredients, uh, put two tablespoons of squeeze uh, lemon juice or calamari seed. Put the magic syrup. Put some that would be so, uh, vinegar. and let it simmer for about 20-25 minutes so it's time to close it for a while let it simmer for about 20-25 minutes and uh, till it becomes saucy and dry and oily so that's how we make our chicken adobo with nano style so once it's simmering, so we lanas we normally put um, sugar or a brown sugar, like one to two tablespoons of sugar to just to balance the taste of the adobo. So we're gonna put some brown sugar, like uh, one tablespoon. And so the purpose of putting some sugar and to make the taste balance, not too salty, not too sour, but just right. Yes, let it 
simmer for a couple of minutes more before we turn off the stove and before we check the finished product. So normally when we cook adobo, we like it dry, oily, and spicy. Like all the ingredients inside the chicken, meat, pork, or any poultry that we're going to use. Hi guys, and uh, now we're going to check the uh, chicken adobo and make sure that it's dry, oily, and spicy. So now let's open and try. The spiciness, the oily, all the ingredients, soy sauce, vinegar, is inside the chicken already. So I'm gonna show you up close on how it looks. There you have it, guys. The chicken adobo picolada style. So as you can see, it's oily, it's dried. That's how I used to cook um, adobo and the uh, bicolana spread. And all the flavors are inside already the chicken. So thanks for watching and stay safe. Bye!